town of Aguafria rode a stranger one fine day. Hardly spoke to folks around him, didn't have too much to say. No one dared to ask his business, no one dared to make a slip. For the stranger there amongst them had a big iron on his hip, a big iron on his hip. It was early in the morning when he rode into the town. He came riding from the south side, slowly looking all around. He's an outlaw loose and running, came the whisper from each lip. And he's headed to some business with a big iron on his hip, with a big iron on his hip. In this town there lived an outlaw by the name of Texas Red. Many men had tried to take him, and that many men were dead. He was vicious and a killer, though a youth of 24. And the notches on his pistol numbered one in 19 more. One in 19 more. Now the stranger started talking, made it plain for folks around. Was an Arizona Ranger, wouldn't be too long in town. He came here to take an outlaw, back alive or maybe dead. And he said it didn't matter, he was after Texas Red, after Texas Red. Wasn't long before the story was related to Texas Red. But the outlaw didn't worry, men they tried before were dead. Twenty men had tried to take him, twenty men had made a slip. Twenty-one would be the ranger with a big iron on his hip, with a big iron on his hip. The morning passed so quickly, it was time for them to meet. It was twenty past eleven when they walked out in the street. Folks were watching from their windows, everybody held their breath. For they knew this handsome ranger was about to meet his death, about to meet his death. There was forty feet between them when they stopped to make their play. And the swiftness of the ranger is still talked about today. Texas Red had not cleared leather when a bullet fairly ripped. And the ranger's aim was deadly with a big iron on his hip. With a big iron on his hip. It was over in a moment, and the folks had gathered round. There before them lay the body of the outlaw on the ground. Oh, he might have gone on living, but he made one fail slip when he tried to match the ranger with a big iron on his hip, with a big iron on his hip. Oh, big iron, oh, big iron. When he tried to match the ranger with a big iron on his hip, with a big iron on his hip. Mary about it I told her about her great sin and Mary cried and forgave me and 
never took me back again Said if I wanted freedom I could be free evermore But I don't want to be I don't want to see Mary cry anymore Oh, devil woman Devil woman, let go of me Devil woman, let me be Leave me alone I want to go home Mary's waiting and weeping Down in our shack by the sea Even after I heard her Mary's still in love with me Devil woman, it's over Trapped no more by your charm Cause I don't wanna stay I wanna get away Woman, let go of my arm Oh, devil woman Devil woman, let go of me Devil woman, let me be Leave me alone I wanna go home Devil woman, you're evil like the dark coral reef Like the winds that bring high tide You bring me sorrow and grief You made me ashamed to face Mary Mary have the strength to tell Skies are not so black Mary took me back Mary has broken your spell Oh, devil woman Devil woman, let go of me Devil woman, let me be Leave me alone, I wanna go home Running along by the seashore Running as fast as I can Even the seagulls are happy I'm glad I'm coming home again Never again will I ever cause another tear to fall Down the beach I see what belongs to me The one I want most of all Oh, devil woman Devil woman, let go of me Devil woman, don't follow me Leave me alone, I want to go home I was hanging around town, just spending my time Out of a job, not earning a dime A fella steps up and he said, I suppose You're a wrong fighter from the looks of your clothes You figures me right, I'm a good one, I claim Do you happen to have any bad ones to tame? Said he's got one and a bad one to buck at throwing good riders, he's had lots of luck. I gets all head up and I ask what he pays to ride this old nag for a couple of days. He offered me ten and I said I'm your man. A bronc never lived that I couldn't fan. He said get your saddle, I'll give you a chance. In his buckboard we hops and he drives to the ranch I stayed until morning and right after Chuck I stepped out to see if this outlaw could buck but Down in the horse corral standing alone Is an old caballo, a strawberry road His legs are all stabbing, he's got pigeon toes Little pig eyes and a big Roman nose 
the little pin ears that touch at the tip. A big 44 brand was on his left hip. The U-neck did oh with a long lower jaw. I could see with one eye he's a regular outlaw. I gets the blinds on him and it sure is a fright. Next comes the saddle and I screws it down tight. Then I steps on him and I raise the blinds. Get out of the way, boys, he's gotta unwind. He sure is a broad walker and he heaves a big sigh. He only likes wings for to be on the fly. He turns his old belly right up to the sun. He sure is a sunfish and son of a gun. He's about the worst bucker I've seen on the range. He'll turn on a nickel and give you some change. He hits on all fours and goes up on high. He leaves me a spinning up there in the sky. I turns over twice and I come back to earth. A lights in a cussing the day of his birth. I know there are ponies that I cannot ride. There's some of them left, they haven't all died. I'll bet all my money that the man ain't alive. That'll stay with old Strawberry when he makes his high dive. And now, my friends, you've asked me what makes me sad and still, and why my brow is darkened like the clouds upon the hill. Run in your ponies closer, I'll tell to you my tale of Utah Carroll, my partner, and his last ride on the trail. We rode the range together and rode it side by side. I loved him like a brother, and I wept when Utah died. We were rounded up one morning, when work was almost done. When on his side the cattle started on a frightened run. Underneath the saddle that the boss's daughter rode, Utah that very morning had placed a bright red robe. So the saddle might ride easy for Lenore, his little friend. And it was this red blanket that brought him to his end. The blanket now was dragging behind her on the ground. The frightened cattle saw it and charged it with a bound. Lenore then saw her danger and turned her pony's face and leaning the saddle tied the blanket to its place but leaning lost her balance fell in front of that wild tide lay still Lenore I'm coming were the words that Utah cried his faithful pony saw her and reached her in a bound I thought he'd been successful and raised her from the ground but the weight upon the saddle had not been felt before. His back since snapped like thunder, and he fell by Lenore. Picking up the blanket, he swung it over his head, and started across the prairie. Lay still Lenore, he said. When he got the stamp, he turned, and saved Lenore, his friend. He turned to face the cattle, and meet his fatal end. His sister flashed like lightning, the report rang loud and clear. As the cattle rushed and killed him, he dropped the leading steer. On his funeral morning, I heard the preacher say, I hope we'll all meet Utah at the roundup far away. Then they wrapped him in a blanket that had saved his little friend and it was this red blanket that brought him to his end
When I was but a young man, I was wild and full of fire. A youth within my teens, but full of challenge and desire. I ran away from home, I left my mother and my dad. I know that grief and so to think their only boy went bad. I fell in with an outlaw bunch, their names were known quite well. How many times we robbed and plundered, I could never tell. This kind of sinful living leads only to a fall. I learned that much and more the night I heard my master's call. One night we rustled cattle, a thousand head or so. And started then out on the trail that leads to Mexico. When the northern wind started blowing and lightning flashed about, I thought someone was calling me. I thought I heard a shout. And at that moment, lightning struck not 20 yards from me. And left there was a giant cross where once there had been a tree. But this time I know I heard a voice so sweet and strange. A voice that came from everywhere, a voice that called my name. So frightened I was thinking of sinful deeds I'd done. I failed to see the thousand head of cattle start to run. The cattle they stampeded were running all around. My pony ran to stumble and it threw me to the ground. I felt the end was near, that death would be the price. When another bolt of lightning showed the face of Jesus Christ. And I cried, oh Lord, forgive me. Don't let it happen now. I want to live for you alone. Oh God, these words I vow. My wicked past unfolded. And I thought of wasted years. When another bolt of lightning killed a hundred head of steers. And the others rushed on by me. But I was left to live. The master had a reason. Life is his to take or give. A miracle performed that night, I wasn't meant to die. The dead ones formed a barricade, at least six or seven high. And right behind it there I was, afraid but safe and sound. I cried in vain for mercy, kneeling there upon the ground. A pardon I was granted, my sinful soul set free. No more to fear the angry waves upon life's stormy seas. Forgiven by the love of God, a love that will remain. I learned that much and more than night the Savior called my name. When I hear coming down it makes me sad and blue was on a rainy night like this that Flo said we were through I told her how I loved her and I begged her not to go but another man had changed her mind so I said good to flow alone within my cell tonight my heart is filled with fear the only sound within the room is the falling of each tear I think about the thing I've done I know it wasn't right they'll bury Tomorrow, but they're hanging me tonight. They're hanging me tonight. That night he came and took my flow and headed into town. I knew I had to find this man 
even try, try to gun him down. As I walked by a dim cafe and I looked through the door, I saw my flow with her new love and I couldn't stand no more. I couldn't stand no more. I took my pistol from my hip and with a trembling hand I took the life of pretty Flo and that good for nothing man and that good for nothing man I think about the thing I've done I know it wasn't right They'll bury Flo tomorrow, but they're hanging me tonight. They're hanging.